Hey, what is going on guys? I'm going to show you how to update the software or the firmware on your LG Smart TV. Very, very simple. Okay, so first thing you want to do is go into your settings. So simply you can go ahead and just grab your remote, click on the settings icon right here. Click on that and then you're going to see this on the right hand side that's going to pop up over here. And now what you want to do is grab your remote and go ahead and keep pressing down, 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 down. And then we want to go down here to the bottom, okay? Mine's, mine down here says all settings. Yours may say advanced, okay? Depending on what model LG TV you have. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, click on advanced. So I'm going to click on enter on my remote. Now give this a second. Now this will pop up. And then from here, I want to go ahead and scroll down all the way down to general. And then once you're at general, go ahead and press the right arrow on your remote. And now we want to go down, keep on going down here, and we want to go down to about this TV, okay? So you see about this TV up here, so go ahead and tap that right there, about this TV. And now we have something down here, okay? So we can go ahead, I mean, check for updates, we can click here, or we can go up here and we can allow automatic updates. If we go ahead and <clears throat> click this on, Basically, if there's a new update and your um, your actual LG TV is connected to the internet, it'll automatically download it, okay? Or you can simply, if you want to, just leave it off and then go ahead and go down and you can check for updates right now. Again, of course, your, um, your TV needs to be hooked up to the uh, internet, you know, whether it's um, through wired or your Wi-Fi network, okay? Anyways, mine here says uh, the latest version of software is avail available for your TV. Do you want to update now? And I do. And you can see on the top there, my latest version, software version up there, it says uh, 4.10.40. And this new version here is 4.10.45. I'm going to go ahead and update this right now. Automatic update system when system is found. So give this a second here. And you can see the status bar right there. So far, it's update and process is at 3%. All right, so we're at 40% now. If you guys wanted to cancel too, you can just go down to where it says cancel update with the remote. Anyways, it's at 42%, almost done, halfway done now. All right, so we're at 99% right now. And we should hit 100% any second now. Okay, so it looks like it updated here. And if I go back down to the general here, go to the right, and I go back down to about this TV. My screensaver kept popping on, so I kept having to go back here. But I will go back to uh, about TV here. And we'll go. Okay, so I basically have to, okay, there was a message that popped up, basically said I had to restart my uh, TV for the uh, update to actually install. So I'm gonna shut it off and turn the TV back on here. Give it a second to uh, boot back up here and then we'll check that software update. Hopefully instead of the uh, version 40, we have the uh, version 45 now. Okay, so it says up here, your TV software has been updated now. So you do have to restart your, your uh, TV, turn it off and turn it back on. Let me just go ahead and make sure that the software update is actually um, at the 45 now instead of the 40. So I'm gonna go back to all settings. Again, yours might say um, advanced. And let's go back down to general. And then move over to the right. And we're gonna go back down to about this TV. There it is, about this TV. And it should be at 45. Yep, it's at 45 before it was at 40. So there you guys go. Hope that helped you guys out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks, bye.